Hi guys, shaking in again. Two and a half weeks till the wedding. <laughs> what am I doing? Um, okay, so I'm starting to do some preparation and as I've told you before guys, you know, um, I've, I've been building and uh, making this board this morning. It's taken me two hours to write this so far, <laughs> to put these letters in so far. <sighs> They're frustrating, especially the little commas. And what it says, we're gonna have this board up at the, on the wedding that it says, fi welcome finally to Shane and Nicole's wedding, the 12th, the 3rd, 22. Established 1996. Five kids, Kane, Dylan, Renee, Tara Lee and Emily. Three grandkids, Lucas, Bronte and Harvey. Plus another one due in August. Shaky Nin's going to be another Nin. Um, and I want to write love and family down the bottom. So I thought I'll do that with you guys. Um, and I'll tell you a bit about what we're doing for the wedding. We've always been... Um, actually, tomorrow... Shane and I have been together 26 years tomorrow. Um, I've never, we've never worried about getting married because I knew that I would never be able to do it. So I used to joke to him all the time that we're gonna get married and say, no, we're not. What do we get married for? We don't need to get married. But as soon as I um, decided to get my life back and said to him, we're getting married, he said, okay. Because he knew as soon as I said it, Really, I meant it. Um, <laughs> this little comma. i got to try and get it in sideways and sort of roll it into place. Oh, I got it. Yay. Um, so when we met, we, um, we had four kids under the age of two and nine months. Shane had one and I had three. Um, and my youngest was four and a half months old. And um, we didn't always have it easy, of course, with a blended family and exes that, quite frankly, never put the kids first. Um, but we dealt with that and we, um, we loved the kids even more because of it. Shane's son came to live with us too when he was eight years old, so we had all five kids. Um, well, when Shane and I had Emily, then we had five kids. And, um, yeah, we like I said, you know, we didn't always have it easy, but I'm so glad we stuck it out. We've got better and better over the years. Actually, we got better and better each time a kid moved out. <laughs> it's true. Um, so you just have to get all your kids to move out. And then <laughs> Stick it out till then, guys. Um, no, but we love them all and we love them all coming back. We've just got Emily to get out yet. <laughs> Hurry up, Em. So I'm putting in a sneaky little ET down the bottom here, if I can get this E in. It doesn't want to cooperate. I might have to. Oh, get in there, bugger. Ugh. Okay, go up one. So for the wedding, I... It, Shane and I, we are no fuss, no fuss, no stress, you know, no bother. And that's what we needed for the wedding. Also, all of our kids and our nieces and nephews are at the age where they're starting to get engaged and have families. So we wanted to show them too that, you know, you can do it easily and cheaply um, and have just as much fun. So I've put that in and what I'm going to do now, this board cost me $8. Um, my daughter was going to throw this out the other week and I thought, no, I'm going to keep that. It might come in handy for a decoration. So when I was doing this this morning, I thought I'm going to stick this around this. It's going to look like one of the ones that you buy and you probably pay $120 for it. I've got an easel and there you go. Isn't that beautiful? A decoration that cost me... Eight dollars. <laughs> so we are going super cheap. I looked online for my wedding dress. I'm going to show you a few things. I looked online for my wedding dress on the website Sheen, um, and they had brand new wedding dresses. 
I found one that sort of I measured myself, size sort of matched. I thought, oh, $49, who cares? If it doesn't fit, I'll, I'll um, gift it to someone else, you know. So I ordered it. It fits perfect. So there's my wedding dress, $49. My shoes, I found them on um, a website, 50% off, $15 my shoes cost me. Now they are high. I don't know whether I'll walk out the back door here. Like I said, I've only got 10 metres to walk from my back door to where Shane's going to be waiting. Um, I will probably kick these off in the first two, <laughs> two steps, but I'm going to try. So they're my shoes, $15. So my outfit's basically done for what? $65. I found all these paper plates, 12 for a dollar. Um, I'm going to paint the bottom of them, the color of the bridesmaid dresses. And um, there we go, I bought five of them. $5, the, the paint cost me $1.10. So $6.10 for 60 serving bowls for the nibblies and that. So that's the, the serving bowls done for $6. Our um, bouquets, I, I was going to get real flowers, but by the time I walk out there, all the petals would be gone. <laughs> so plastic it is. These are in our Kmart store, $5. How cute are they? I'm gonna hang some ribbon from them. Bouquets are done, four bouquets, $20. The ribbon cost me a dollar, so probably $23 for the um, the bouquets. So guys, anyone out there, you know, thinking about a, a wedding, don't go to the expense. You know, I could not go to venues and organize all that. No way in the world, it's in our backyard. We're getting pizzas delivered, we're just partying. The ceremony is going to go for about 15 minutes, which is we're all invited to. Um, and then we're going to party all night. It's just a huge party and that's all we want. No fuss, no stress. Um, once the ceremony is over, it's not about us anymore. It's about having a great night. So, guys, that's a little bit into it. Two and a half weeks to go. Um, time to start doing things, I suppose, and getting ready for it. But we'll wait and see. All right, guys, have a great shaky weekend. Uh, oh, no, week. It's Tuesday. Uh, see, I don't even know what day it is. <laughs> Everyone that's um, commenting in the last couple of videos, Facebook hasn't letting, been letting me see the comments, um, but it is today. So I'll get back to all those comments. I love you all. Take care, stay safe, and I will see you all on Friday. Bye, guys.